I'm uh, Robert Olin Butler, and I'm the Francis Epps Distinguished Professor of Creative Writing in the English Department. And um, I came to Florida State University back in 2000. Prior to that, um, way prior to that, I went off to Northwestern University as an undergraduate expecting to be an actor. They have a great theater school. I got to Northwestern, had some considerable success in my freshman year in plays, but decided at some point I'd rather write the words than interpret them. So, uh, however, because I was in the theater, I assumed I wanted to be a playwright. So I stayed in the theater department and then went off to University of Iowa to get a master's degree in playwriting. And it turned out, um, though I'm, I'm not sure they were fully aware of it, but um, I was a really terrible playwright. I should have known better because my most impassioned writing was going into the stage directions, which is a very bad sign for a playwright. Uh, and then, expecting fully to go off and get a PhD after that, I got gobbled up in the pre-lottery day draft into the Vietnam War. And um, I ended up in Vietnam uh, having, however, been first trained as a counterintelligence special agent in, 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 and then sent to language school for a full year. I studied full-time the Vietnamese language, so when I got to Vietnam, I was actually fluent in Vietnamese. That was the life-changing experience for me, needless to say. Uh, I fell in love with uh, Vietnam and the Vietnamese people and culture. Uh, the landscape and the people and the, and the language and the sensibility. And I spent about five months working in the countryside and then spent seven months working in Saigon where I, almost every night after midnight I would wander out of my... I actually worked in a civilian clothes job at Saigon City Hall and lived in an old French hotel in Saigon. And after midnight I'd wander into the steamy back alleys of Saigon, where nobody ever seemed to sleep, crouch in the doorways with people and speak to them in their language, and they were a warm, generous, spirited people, and I submerged myself into their culture. They, uh, 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 and learned a great deal, not only about them, but about the human condition. Came back to America, and then spent the next uh, couple of decades working as a the editor of a business newspaper in New York City, and I was writing novels on my lap uh, before laptop computers on by hand on legal pads, and I uh, wrote my first four published novels, Commuting on the Long Island Railroad. Finally had enough publishing credits that um, I was able to get a teaching job in creative writing at a university over in Louisiana called McNeese State University. And uh, I taught there for 15 years and then had the chance to come over here in this Francis Epps professorship and um, have been for the last 15 and a half years as of this videoing uh, coming into the spring semester of 2016. Uh, I've been here at Florida State University. And this has been an extraordinary experience for me. I have wonderful, brilliant writing colleagues. The university is a very nurturing place. The students here are terrific. And I've actually been very fruitful uh, in my creative output. In my 15 and a half years, uh, I've written 11 books here at Florida State University. And, uh, you know, it took me about 18 years to go from being in Vietnam to my first book, written in the voices of Vietnamese people, which is the book that won the Pulitzer Prize back in 1993, Good Scent from a Strange Mountain. It only took me 15 years to actually begin to write about, uh, uh, well, a, a book set at the uh, the New Leaf Co-op, or it starts in the New Leaf Co-op, set in Tallahassee. So I've just finished, as of this taping, um, it's still to come out in the fall of 2016, but it's a book called Perfume River, and will be my first Tallahassee novel. So um, that's the career in a nutshell, and I'm very happy that uh, I ended up here at uh, Florida State University.